Hello everyone. I just wanted to put a video on about numbers, number sequences, because we're all seeing them everywhere right now. It's the number one way that the universe is communicating with us right now. The universe is saying, hello, I'm here. Are you aware? Are you awake? Are you watching? And, you know, it's like the the universe is knocking on the door and saying, I am here, I am here, notice me, I am giving you signs every single day. And there's so many of us right now getting these signs through number sequences. So I thought I'd talk a little bit about them. I see numbers everywhere, all the time, repetitive numbers, I know you will be too. You see them in the most miraculous ways, in the most amazing places. You see them on car number plates, you see them on cars themselves, on walls. You see them when you pick your phone up at a certain time and it's 11.11 or uh, 2.22 or... 444, you see it on the microwave, the washing machine, the numbers are everywhere and it's because the angels are getting signs across to you that you are loved and protected and that you really have nothing to worry about. Pretty much every time we see a number sequence, even though they all have different meanings, they all mean the same thing. They all mean the same thing and that is have faith trust in the universe, trust in the process of your life and surrender, surrender and let go. The most amazing one is 1111. You know, it's to do with keeping your thoughts positive. It's the number that you see the most when you're starting to awaken. You know, when you first awaken to your spiritual journey, when you pulled out of the matrix and you open your eyes to the real world, to what's really going on, that you're not just a person in a human body, that you are a soul, um, a spirit living in a human body, that you are source energy, that you are a magnificent creator. You start seeing the numbers 1111 everywhere. You pick your phone up 1111, you know, 1111, it's there, it's, it's just everywhere. And 1111 is like two big columns. You know, imagine two big number ones, you know, it's like a doorway. You're being moved through this doorway into new beginnings and unlimited potential. It's the universe's way of saying, you know, you're moving on to the next chapter of your spiritual growth, of your spiritual journey. And, you know, you see anyway, even when, when you're aware, when you're aware of your spiritual journey, you'll start seeing 1111 because the angels are saying, keep your thoughts positive. You know, yes, it's a real journey. 1111 is a real number for twin flames as well. You know, a lot of twin flames see that number on their journey because you know that it's real. You've been shown it's all real. But ultimately, the angels tell me it's about awakenings going on and it's about being told from heaven to keep your thoughts positive to keep your thoughts positive that you are manifesting quickly what you want and that new beginnings are ahead and that you have unlimited potential the next huge number sequence the one that i love seeing and i see all the time at the moment is 222 222 is like you've gone through the doorway and now the world is your oyster, you know, the world is your oyster, you have forces from above protecting you, helping you and watching over you, allowing you to create anything you want, so it's like now you're in partnership with the universe, so 1111 is kind of like you're awakening to your potential and to everything that's happening, 222 is like you're now in partnership with the universe and the universe is allowing you to manifest and create your dreams and your desires. It's, it's a real sign, 222, that the universe has your back, that you are loved and supported and protected and that you are now on the right path. So, you know, it doesn't matter if you've been on in your spiritual journey for a year, six months, two minutes, or ten years, if you start seeing two, 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 you know, it's it's the same that, you know, everything's falling into place now. You're at a real place of alignment where if you work in harmony with the universe, everything you desire will line up for you. So two, two, two is a real sign 
that you've partnered up with the universe. How amazing is that? That you're in partnership with the wonderful, magical universe. I just think it's absolutely beautiful. And then we've got 333. Now, 333 is a huge sign that not only have you aligned with the universe, but now you've kind of activated the support not only of the angels and the ascended masters and spirit, but everybody watching over you in heaven, including the God energy of Jesus and, you know, that beautiful kind of triangle, the three triangle, you know, the dynamic of the three, that you've now created something so magical that you are harnessing all of the wonders of the universe. Everybody that's ever passed over and is eternal and watching over you, is now helping you achieve your dreams. It's about balance. It's about unity. It's about a coming together. It's saying, you know, your power is increasing. You know, anything that's gone on in your life that's created stress, illusion, worry, turmoil, um, anything like that is moving into the past and you're bringing harmony in. It's about balance. You know, I love it so much when you see threes. When I first started on my spiritual journey, um, I changed my phone number. I've got a different number now, but I changed my number and there was three, there was three, three, three in that phone number. And that was a huge sign that I was on the right path I was creating and I was manifesting. So, you know, it's great to see twos, but it's even better when you start seeing threes. And if you see all the numbers... You know, the universe is just saying, you know, everybody's with you, so you're okay, you've got absolutely nothing to fear. So threes is just another sign that you've kind of moved to the next step. You know, you, you've so you've opened the gateway for the new beginnings. You've partnered up with the universe, and now you're bringing all the resources in that you need because you're now in balance with the universe when you're seeing threes. How amazing is that? Then we've got... 444. Four, four. Wow, I love 444. Four, four. It's the number that the angels are with you, you know? They all, I mean, all the numbers mean the angels are with you, but when you see fours, it's extra special because it's a real sign that you've got angelic assistance behind you, that the angels are, are supporting you and helping you manifest whatever you want. You know, it's a real sign that everything is falling into place and that you were overcoming obstacles, that you were getting more powerful, that you were blessed, that you were loved, that you were protected, that you can manifest anything that you desire. Your power is increasing. All these signs, wow, absolutely superb. I just love seeing fours. So if you're seeing fours, angels are with you, baby. Angels are with you. So ask them for another sign. Ask them for another sign, you know. Show me feathers, coins, anything. Just show me that you're with me. And usually if you're seeing fours, you know, you'll hear angel, um, like music, of lyrics with angels in or something connected with angels. You'll get other signs. If you see the number 555, five, five, it's a huge sign that there's big rumbling changes going on in your life, that there's major change and transformation. For me, the number fives, like five, 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 is a bit like turning over the death card in the tarot. It means you're going through a rebirth period, that one period of your life is finished, one chapter is over, and you're moving into the next one. So, you know, there could be some chaos and upheaval going on around you when you're seeing fives, because you're being guided in a new direction. You're making life changes that will bring blessings in. So, it's a real sign of change when you're seeing fives. When you're seeing sixes... When you're seeing sixes like 666 six or 666, six, six, it doesn't mean the devil's got you. It doesn't mean anything like that. All it means is that you're focusing on ego and on ego things rather than spiritual things. So it's a real message when you're seeing sixes to go within and to not worry so much about the 3D plane, about material stuff, money, um, security, um, anything to do with the actual life, the real world, if you know what I mean. 
the angels are saying don't focus on that so much it's not important and usually it means you're worried about finances or you try and manifest finances or you're stressing over finances or you're worrying too much about the material side of things you're worrying too much about the actual physical world instead of letting go and surrendering and having faith in the universe if you see sevens 777 77 or 777 and i love the number 777 i see it all the time on taxis on cabs because you know when i see them they park outside my house at times with the number 777 and i'm like wow it's a massive sign you're manifesting it's a massive sign that your intentions and whatever you're sending out there is coming into fruition it just means that everything is becoming whole again. So, you know, you can be excited when you see sevens. And, you know, sometimes I'll go to the shop and it'll come to 777, you know. And I'm like, oh, yay, what I'm, what I'm manifesting is coming true. So when you start seeing sevens, you can get very excited that everything you're sending out to the universe, all the intentions you're setting are coming true. A massive sign for manifestation. If you see 8 or 88 or 888, brilliant sign for money. It means financial abundance, support, re resources, anything financially is coming into you. I absolutely love the numbers 8, 88, 88, oh, 88, 888. So I'm getting excited talking about numbers. Um, and you know, if you're seeing eights, it means you're just doing everything right. You've got the Midas touch right now, that things are just starting to fall into place. So, you know, you'll see more money coming. You'll see more abundance. You may be seeing money on the floor. It happened to me the other day on the bus because whenever you get shown money, um, it means the universe is saying, do you want more of it, you know? It doesn't matter if, if you, you should always... Um, if you want to give a tip to somebody, always take the money back first and then give the tip. Otherwise, you say you don't want that money. The amount of people that say, um, you know, I don't want that penny. Or, you know, you're telling the universe you don't want abundance. So if you walk past money on the floor, even if it's a penny, the angels are saying, the universe is saying, money is flowing to you. Do you want it? So pick up the money, you know. You will hear about gurus doing this. Um, it doesn't mean that, you know that there's anything horrible about you that you're a scummy person because you're picking up money off the floor it means the universe is sending it to you and the other day it happened to me i was sitting on the bus and i was having a wonderful abundant day and there was 5p on the floor in the aisle right by where i was and i was looking at this 5p it was just looking at me and you know this this voice was saying you need to pick that up liz it's the universe showing you money you know and I was thinking, oh, what will people think if they see me pick that 5p up, you know? What will people think? And this voice said, you'd pick it up if it was 5 million. You'd pick it up if it was 5 million. So I just leant down and picked up the 5p. And I said, thank you for more money and prosperity coming into my life. And that day, I had miracles happen. You know, there was money knocked off things. I got things free. I had gifts coming at me. You know, it just shows money is coming. So if you're seeing the number eight, and this is why I get a little piece of paper and I draw a number eight and red pen and I put it in my purse. Gents, you can do it with your wallet, put it in your wallet. It brings money in. And, you know, I've had miracles in my life and clients tell me all the time when they start putting the number eight in the purse, they attract more money to them. So eight is a great sign, eight, eighty-eight, or even eight, eight, eight. It means abundance and money coming to you. And then we've got nine. So nine, nine, nine. What does that mean then? That means you're coming to a phase in your life that's coming to an end and new beginnings are coming in. So you, you're opening up to your spiritual side that you know, you've got a spiritual path that you need to be undertaking. So you may be in a transition from what you've believed in materially to what you believe in spiritually. So nines is a time of awakening, new beginnings, fresh start. So 
you know, I just love these numbers. And the thing is, we get shown so many different number sequences. And, you know, like you see the number 14, 15, 16, they all mean something. And I'm not going to go into all of them. I just wanted to give you the main number sequences, the ones that really get our juices flowing. But if you're seeing... Um, number sequences you know you can google them Doreen Virtue's got a wonderful book out there about angel numbers and you know ultimately the angels are getting signs across to you the universe is getting signs across to you communicating to you in numbers so make sure you're noticing what you're seeing today because I can guarantee you the angels will be showing you some form of number sequence to make your day complete have a wonderful day and I'll see you soon